Hi there, this is Dr. Jeremy. So many of our patients are afflicted with allergies and sensitivities from toxins. In this short video clip taken from one of my recent live training events, I explained two powerful electroacupuncture protocols to modulate the immune system, eliminate any allergy, and provide your patients fast relief. Now, if you love this type of learning, at the very end, I'll show you a way to dive deep and attend my upcoming event. Please enjoy. As you know, we can probably choose a specialty and make a whole practice surrounding it. For example, allergies. But I encourage you to be bigger than that, and that's what this class is about. Use the paradigm, use the pattern, and use the protocols to be able to handle almost any disease. Now, I want to show you allergy treatments because what happens, pathogens from infections and cavitations, which we know are affecting the majority of our population, can put out toxins and our body can become allergic to it so that people can have allergies to certain toxins put out by pathogens. Now, we can also acquire allergies to the dental materials, the mercury, the porcelain, the gold, whatever it is. And an, a great thing to do if you're going to get some dental work first, never get a silver filling, never get a mercury filling. They call a silver filling. When they say, oh, I'm going to give you a silver filling, there's mercury in there, so don't be tricked. You're never going to get mercury. Nonetheless, there's other dental materials that you can still be sensitive to, you can still have allergies to, and so they have something called a biocompatibility blood test where they test you for a hundred or a couple hundred different dental materials to find what's the best dental material for you. And a holistic dentist will be able to prescribe that for you, and it's great. It's really great. For example, not many people are allergic to gold. That's why I have gold fillings, but I wound up being allergic to gold. If I would have had that biocompatibility blood test, I would have known that before I got the gold fillings. I was allergic to gold because I had the treatment that I'm about to show you done on me, and now I would say I'm 95% fixed for my gold allergy, if not 100% fixed for my gold allergy. I'm about to show you that. We have two main ways of treating allergies or immune system overreaction, or I'm going to show you two main ways. I'm sure there's a bunch of others. But in our modality, electroacupuncture medicine in Dow, I'm going to show you two fantastic ways. Here's the first one. These points, this, this comes from Dr. Stripmatter's book, which I listed as a reference in the back. Here is her ear allergy and hay fever treatment. I've gotten fantastic results on this. Now, these points, you're not supposed to treat every single point. You're supposed to diagnose which points are the major ones and only treat two or three of them max. You can do this with a point dough select, which I'll show you, or you could do this with an ear probe or some other method, whatever you like, the Voss pulse if you're good at that. These are listed in order of should, that you should check in. In other words, number one on this is more important than number nine on this for this protocol. So you want to start in this order. First, test number one, the ear allergy point, which is here. Now, these are ear side specific, which I've also listed here on this slide set here. In other words, I would check the left ear number one. I wouldn't check the right ear number one. Or I would check well, number two is different. Number two does exist on both sides. But number three is only on the left side. Number four is only on the right side, so on and so forth. Now, when you come to number one, it's not a point. It's an area. I would have to check. We would, should check the top of the ear and even underneath the ear and all over in this area for the most reactive point. You can do that with con electrical conductance, like a point to select, which I'm going to show you. 
Or you can do that with that with that probe. Um, the probe works pretty good once once you get good at it. And again, you can use a semi-permanent needle like you saw yesterday, or you can use seeds, or you can use needles with electricity. In any case, you should be able to get good result with all those different methods. And I'll try to demo needles with electricity, which is very common in the clinic. Two needles, hook up the machine, go to the next room. Now, here is another fantastic way, not only to treat allergies, but to treat overreactions to toxins. This, what you see here, is actually the entire liver area. Notice the liver organ is on the right, and this only exists on the right ear. We saw this in the tooth chart, where the right ear can only treat and diagnose the right-sided teeth where the left ear can only diagnose and treat the left-sided teeth. So back to this, when, it, when a liver is diseased, this area becomes this large, huge, right? So it's not really a point anymore. When you treat this, when you treat the correct area, and if you're gonna stick needles in here, this is the endoderm area, so you can use about 4.6 hertz for Noget's frequency resonance. When you treat the right area in about two to five treatments, this liver area will shrink and shrink and shrink until it becomes a point again, as the patient's getting better in terms of reducing their allergic reaction and reducing their toxin load. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button now. And if you wish to find out more information regarding my upcoming live event, other blog posts, or electroacupuncture medicine in general, more information can be found below this video. I'll see you soon.